ho, ho. What up, what up, what up? It's yours truly, Mr. Telefero. My annual Christmas giveaway is on the way. Last year, we did it on YouTube. This year, we're going to do it on my Instagram account. So if you want to win AirPods, gift cards, and a lot of other stuff, you want to make sure you're following me on Instagram. At is Mr. Telefero. You're in the running to potentially win some AirPods and a lot of cool gifts this holiday season. Enjoy the video. What's going on? It's yours. Truly just say it with me. They call me Miss Telefair. How's everybody doing out there? Look, I am a member of the media, but when a when an artist or whomever, an entertainer or whomever, when they have a point, I'll sit back and say, yo, no, he's got a point. Meek Mill, on this specific topic, he has a great point. I got to give it to him. He has a point. So Meek Mill's got a new artist, goes by the name of Young Ro, recently signed him to the Dream Chasers. Young Ro, as of two weeks ago, was not a known commodity in the rap game. He's still not known for his music overall. But this week, Young Ro has been beefing with Blueface. Blueface decided to get him Meek Mill's new artist, Young Ro's business. See, I'm even doing it right now. And uh, Young Ro and, Meek and Blueface have been going back and forth on social media. Well, you know every blog site is leading with the headline, Meek Mill's artist beefing with Blueface, right? And that's really not fair to Meek Mill. Now, Meek understands the clickbait era of headlines. He's been a part of his share of headlines. All right? He was a pawn in the, in the beef between himself and Drake. A lot of those headlines read, Nicki Minaj's boyfriend beefs with Drake. So he's been a part of some very high-profile stuff. He gets it, but I can understand Meek's frustration. I mean, this dude... Spending his what first calendar year out of prison in quite some time, or not on house arrest or probation or anything in a long time. He's getting money. He's trying to help uh, change the legal system. He's trying to keep black dudes out of jail. Let's call a spade a spade. And he don't want his name attached to any bad headlines because it's not just uh, little petty outlets like Miss Telefero and other outlets, but it's mainstream outlets picking up on this story, leading with the headline Meek Mills artist young roll is beefing with blueface meek mill don't want no parts of it he went on his twitter account and he went off and i appreciate it and i respect it he said stop saying meek mill's artist is young roll and stop putting my name with that kitty shit meek mill on some other shit do y'all post the owners of these major label labels when artists popping shit on the net y'all got these young bulls arguing about nothing let these youngins grind and stop gassing them up the beef I try to be quiet, but I'm watching y'all trying to line my team with these bogus tricks. I don't want any involvement in that shit. And yes, I'm really cut like that. I'm just trying to change the law right now. Uh, first off, Meek's 100% right in, in one regard. I disagree with him saying that the media is the only people trying to line his artists up uh, into a beef with Blueface. First off, Meek, if your artist really comes from that lifestyle, he's got to be smart enough at this point in the game to not fuck up his own back. But I agree with Meek Mill 100% when he's saying, you know, when an artist is signed to a rapper, we're quick to say Meek Mill's artist this, you know, well, whomever it is, T.I.'s artist that, uh, Gucci Mane's artist this, we'll leave with that. But what about when an artist is signed to a label? Like, you don't hear uh, me saying anything uh, about Atlantic. Who's over at, at Atlantic? I could name a plethora of, of heads over there at, at Atlantic. And I don't, when NBA Youngboy is involved in the beef, you don't hear me say Mike Kaiser's artist NBA Youngboy is beefing because y'all don't even know who the hell Mike Kaiser is for the most part. Y'all don't care. It's only relevant when you can use another artist in it. And we got to stop that shit. I'm talking about media. I'm talking to us. I'm talking to self included. And I'm going to cognitively think about this going forward when I create headlines and I do what Meek Mill is saying. That ain't right to artists like Meek. He, all he's trying to do is give a young in a position. And look at us making some shit out of nothing. He's like, keep my name out of that. And I respect it. Now, Meek's right. We wrong about this one, y'all. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment box below. Look, I don't mind that men when I'm wrong, when the media's wrong. It's other people who like to double down on their bullshit. That ain't me. We wrong, we wrong. As simple as that. Thank y'all so much for the time, love, support. I don't take it for granted. Salute. I'm out. I came from nothing, but I want everything God has for me. I interview celebrities. I talk sports. I still represent the coach. I got the kids. They tuned in. Tuned in. We locked in right now, Mr. Telefair. Mr. Telefair. Telefair. Shout out to Mr. Telefair. Watching Mr. Telefair TV. Mr. Telefair TV.